Hello again, YouTube. This is Wolverine. Um, I'm just gonna review some of these uh, show items, like I guess you can say. Man, I'm not really that big of a fan of show items just because they got no use really besides just to look at. So, and generally they're not very made very well, but okay. I got these on budk.com and they're Reddick blades. They're the cheaper ones too. I didn't really see the point of buying more expensive ones when it's just for show anyways. And I just think the design's kind of cool. I've always thought they were ever since I saw Reddick, but it's them. They're not made very well. The wrap's definitely not good. I don't know if you can see that, but kind of crappy but I mean I just I only got it just because I like the shape and I just think it's pretty cool so uh, that's them and I think that I got them for like around maybe 20 bucks I think so I'll just put them off to the side uh, Next item I got, I've always loved Predator ever since I was a little kid, so I just got a Predator mask. It's pretty cool. It's actually got some good weight. I think it's like maybe like eight pounds. I don't know. It's pretty heavy. It's really cool. It has like little alien designs on the top. It has eye holes. Doesn't have a breathing, any breathing holes, but I don't know. It's more of a wall hanger. I don't know if you can see that here. See it? It's like a wall hanger, but it also does have straps that you could strap to your head. But I tried that, and it just it, it weighs so much that it doesn't really want to stay on your head. So I mean, it's just a pretty cool showpiece. I like it. This is my last showpiece item. It's a mini katana. It's kind of cool. It's supposed to be a letter opener. I got this in a surprise bag off of Bud K. It just came with I'm pretty sure it comes with all of them, to be honest. I watched a couple on YouTube, and they all had something like this. But I got a pretty cool one. Favorite color is black and red, so I was pretty happy. It has a little sheath. Made out of plastic, but still pretty cool. Okay, goodbye YouTube. Oh wait, 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 never mind. I forgot I have two more show items. I heard on YouTube that some people tried to throw them and they broke apart and stuff. But I'm just gonna use that as show. First day I got this actually, I uh, cut my finger on it. Cause I, some of the locks weren't really like loose yet. They were brand new, so they are kind of funky. <laughs> and I cut my finger on it trying to put it away. <laughs> but it's pretty cool. Five different blades and they all fold in. And just like that one, I got Cyclone. That blade's actually still the lock. I think this is the one I can cut myself on actually. It's called the Cyclone, it has three blades. The blades are bigger, much bigger, almost about half the size that I want this. It's pretty cool. So, those are the items that I got for show. I mean, technically, a lot of my stuff is for show just because the quality is kind of poor as in actual use it would bust apart but that's just because I buy low end stuff because I don't want to get too invested to where like if it was crap that I just wasted a lot of money on crap yeah man this way I'm, I'm happy with what I get and I can have fun at the same time I like knives okay goodbye YouTube for now